You tell me if these look like genuine refugees fleeing war and death to you. To me, they look like economic migrants cheering because they have arrived in what they believe is a paradise. That video was on a Facebook page with this caption at the top Congratulations Tunis to Italy successfully They've also thrown in some party time emojis for good measure Doesn't seem like something genuine refugees would say And the behaviour on the boat does not seem like that of genuine refugees Seems like the behaviour of entitled economic migrants to me if you have just fled war and death, you'd not be smiling and laughing. You'd just be overwhelmed by a sense of relief, maybe even tears and hugs of relief, just glad to be safe. This lot looks like they've just arrived at their holiday destination, and to them, that is exactly the case. They think Europe is paved with gold and will do anything to get there, to get their piece of the pie. Noticed how they are all men? Just like throughout history, it has always been predominantly men who have gone to foreign lands in search of adventure and fortune. And it is no different here. And also, this narrative that they all must be incredibly desperate to escape certain death to get on boats and make this dangerous journey is simply not true. Five people just perished after taking a ridiculously dangerous journey over two and a half miles under the sea. Were they desperate? No, of course not. Lots of people taking same risks all the time for all sorts of reasons. No doubt many of these will be coming north with many wanting to get to the UK. They do it because they know we are a soft touch and easily taken advantage of. That needs to change because there'll be a lot more where they came from and we can't be expected to take in the world.